Microsoft has released a preview version of Windows 8, which is the new version of the Windows operating system, which is set to debut later this year. Now, it's unlike anything that you've seen from Windows before, so let's take a look. Now, Windows 8 is designed for a tablet and a PC that's different than previous versions of Windows, which were only designed for a monitor and a keyboard. We're using a old, a five-year-old Dell laptop, which has an Intel Centrino processor. It's not a particularly fast processor, but it's important to know how lightweight Windows 8 is. It actually starts up in just 16 seconds. That's actually shorter than the amount of time, about half the amount of time actually, that a iPhone 4S takes to start up. So the first screen that you get to in Windows 8 is uh, the launch screen. So we're just going to flick this up. It works just as well with the mouse. So the different tiles here are actually interactive. Um, they can display information. For instance, it tells me right now that it's 62 degrees and sunny. It's a nice day here in New York. Windows has done a nice job at curating um, all of users' social networks into one app they call the People app, and it actually gives you uh, all your Facebook and Twitter and LinkedIn and other social networking information all in one spot. What's also interesting about Windows 8 is that the desktop, the traditional desktop that uh, you're used to seeing, is actually an app. There's one notable difference, there's actually no start button. If you go to where you think the start button should be, you actually will just go back to their new version of start, which is the user interface they're calling Metro. The Windows App Store is actually really interesting as well. Uh, this has all kinds of apps that you would normally find on a tablet, optimized for touch applications, uh, including things like Cut the Rope or uh, Kindle. So what's interesting is that with Windows you have to, you're used to closing out of applications, but uh, that's not what Windows 8 is all about. You actually just can leave a bunch of applications open. That's very different than the experience that you might have with the Apple iPad, for instance, which only allows certain apps to multitask. It looks fantastic. It's very, very speedy. Even running on this five-year-old laptop, Windows 8 is faster than my Windows 7 PC, which is a brand new device. It's really different than anything that you've used before, and that's the key. Microsoft wants this to rejuvenate the Windows line, just like Windows 95 did. This really is the biggest evolution in Windows in 17 years. It's going to be interesting to see what kind of devices come out when Microsoft releases this later this year.